Hello, everyone. I am Nikusha Shetty, yes. And this is Rishita P. Today, we'll be making a project known as My Calculator. We'll be using the site code.org app lab. So, let's begin. So, now I have opened code.org. You can also type studio.code.org. You'll be seeing the screen like this. Now, here, click on create. Here, now click on app lab. So, you'll be seeing this screen after that. So, here, click on rename and make it to my calculator. And click on save. Here, first, what you need is the theme should be changed in those letters and make this a bit big. You can change the theme to anything which you want. Now, take a label and adjust. And keep the text as my calculator. Now I'll change the font size, text alignment to center, font size to 20, background color to white. And text color to black. Now, after this, you have to have some label and text input side by side. First, we'll do first part, then the second part of this. The first part is to have label this side a bit big. Now, first text should be enter your first number. So, this is to small. I'll change the font size here too and make the border with a changes to it would be 3 font size would be 20 text alignment center that's it here now you'll be needing a text input so let me just bring it out here The height should be the same. So here is 50, and I think this is a more. Let me change this also as 50. Uh, so this is the first part. Now, the second part of this is you have to duplicate them again. Both one. So that you'll be able to put two numbers for the questions. Here again, it should not be enter your first number. Enter it can be second number. Second number. So I think the number is not just properly. So I'll make this a bit bigger. and the same over here too. Now this is okay. Now you'll be needing buttons, labels only. So the label would be used for the result and the buttons for addition, subtraction, division, multiplication and clear. So let's do that. Take a label. Adjust it to this big. Change this background color to the same as this one so you can just 
copy this and paste here now uh, go here and put the text to result and the id should be result this is the main thing and the text should put like this now the font size again i'll be increasing and text alignment to center now again a label so that it can show the answer me just make near to this let me put this much so that uh, how much java big it is it can come still here at least Change the font size to 20 and text alignment to center. And remember that text should be nothing. Now, this is how it looks. Now, you will be needing button. Let me just first arrange the button. And another button over here. Let me make a bit more space for the result so that the screen is filled. If we don't want that to be done, then the other option is that you can write app is by is done by whom. Now go to the first button, which is this, and put the text as addition. And here it should be PTN and uh, underscore addition. Likely you'll be making this a subtraction multiplication and division respectively here i'll just make the border easier a bit so that it becomes circle in shape or oval in shape likely so let me do this one now this also subtraction Now I'll make the water radius same as the addition. So it was 29 and make this also as 29. Now this is okay. Now this one, this first I'll make everything water radius to 29 except the last button which is this one. Well, in this button, you can put division and the uh, ID should be btn division underscore division. If you are putting different, at coding you have to do accordingly. Now we did this too. Now let's do this one. So it's multiplication, so let's do this. And the ID would be BTN underscore multiplication. Now this is done. Now let's do coding for this, but uh, designing for this but before that 
let me just make this a bit big and keep it here because the manipulation was not properly visible. Now this here the tag should be clear. Sorry, clear. Clear now. The uh, ID should be button underscore clear. Now let's do the border radius. I'll be making it into 60. Say 66. So now we did the design part. After coding, let's see how this app works. Welcome back to Cutie Pie session. For my calculator, my friend Nikisha have already done design for my calculator. Now it's time to finish our my calculator, and for that we need to do coding. Let's begin. So now I am in code.org website and there I am in app lab. Now, firstly I have re renamed my project as my calculator. Now let me continue it. For coding in toolbox group you need to click on UI control and there you need to drag and drop on event. Now, in the design tab for addition, I had given the ID as this one. So now I'm going to copy this one, go to code, and it will rename this as the one that I had renamed in the addition. Now I need to go on with the coding. So here you can see here get number. I need to drag and drop this one and put it here sorry set number so it is set number that we need to uh, drag and drop now delete this one go to addition again in the design tab here I had given a text input one so you need to write it here, text input 1. See here, text. Here in the zero column that you can see, we are going to go to the map and then here I need to add this one. Okay. And now go again to UI controls and then here I need to add get number. Okay. So then let me add one more also first. So now I have got it. Okay. So instead of writing here text input 1, we need to write it over here. So here we need to write it as result. I just wrote there so that we will not get confused. Okay. Result I have written it here. Actually the thing is that the in the design tab, whichever ID you had give, given in the result, you need to add that one. So I have given that result itself. So now I should add the same here. In the get number ID, put it as text number one. So you're adding those both, right? So text input.
so here it's done okay now the same you need to do for all the four which means you need to do the same for the subtraction multiplication and division so let's do it so now i'm going to show you the coding again because there are some people who do silly mistakes when we do coding right so let me show you that so firstly we need to change the symbols for each one of coding for addition subtraction multiplication and division okay so this is one and all the symbols you are not going to get in UI control but you are going to get in math which is the same in the toolbox then here you need to drag and drop set number not get number so this is the one that we normally make mistakes then here in result we are not supposed to take this ID of result because this is just the showing one for the answer but we need to take where the answer should come right so we need to take this one's id so now let me show you how it will look after all this coding okay so now let me show you i'll write number three and here four and then addition it comes seven subtraction it comes minus one multiplication it comes 12 and division it comes 0 0.75 which means all this is correct but we have done even one more button which is clear yes all is done so now our my calculator project is totally done summary this project was done by nikisha shrikiyas and Krishita p we made a app or a project known as my calculator we use the site code.org here we use app lab the link which was used or for your reference the link is this one if you click on this you'll be able to see the project let's go to that and the design used for this project is this one and the code used is this one thank you stay home stay safe